You're looking bright-eyed and bushy-tailed today. <laughs> Are you free right now, Grandpa? Well, this is surprising. What did you need? I want to train some more. Can you help me? <laughs> Looks like someone's full of energy. All right, let's give it a shot. Hooray! Okay, that's enough sparring for today. Really? But I'm not tired yet. Yeah, but you're still young. Remember, rest is an important part of training. Aww. Come on, it's okay. When I was a kid, I got stronger thanks to all the breaks I took. You did? Yep. Master Roshi would always tell us, Work hard, study well, and eat and sleep plenty. <laughs> I didn't know that. Okay, I'll rest too. But just sitting around and resting is boring. Tell me a story, Grandpa. Okay, about what? You! I want to know more about your training and how you got to be so strong. Well, let's see. To get as strong as I am now, of course, I did a lot of training. Like, a lot of training. But I also met all kinds of people along the way and fought tons of powerful opponents. Whoa! I bet you beat every strong person you ran into, right, Grandpa? That's not true. I've been beaten plenty of times. Huh? Really? But those experiences made me stronger and motivated me to work even harder. Oh. Han? We're going shopping now. Shopping? I told you yesterday that we were going into town. Did you forget? Oh, whoopsies. All right, come on. <laughs> well, that's enough chatting for now. Go have fun, Pan. Okay. See you later, Goku. Later. Speaking of strong opponents, it's been a while since I fought him. And that guy's giving off the same vibe. Well, you know what that means. I should train more. I'll go there. It's been too long. All right. Oh, hey, Dad. Go on. What are you doing here? Just reading. I love how quiet it is here. I come by every once in a while and it puts me in a good mood. A place like this does that for you, huh? What are you doing here, Dad? Well, I thought I'd do some mental training. I was trying to think of places where I could concentrate at and this popped into my mind. Now that I think about it, this is the spot you used when I was little, right? <laughs> You remembered! Anyway, good luck with your training. Thanks. You said you were going to do some mental training, right? Shouldn't you get started? Yeah, I think I will. I'll make a mental image of those guys. I have to remember what it was like to fight them.
stronger than I was. Every attack he threw at me was super dangerous. I thought I was gonna lose that one, to tell you the truth. You're just what I expected from you, Freeza. Look at those killer moves. Freeza was too much to keep the Keto Piccolo in you. And killed Krillin. Freeza, I can't ever forgive you for now. You have perfect training done. in another battle? All right. Last but certainly not least. Boom! You'll be my final opponent. You put me and my friends in so much hell. It's only fair for you to be my training dummy this time. Oh, man! He strikes out at the first sign of game weakness. You gotta keep moving so you can't lock on to me. Yeah! 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 
Guess you're done. Hmm? Huh? You're still here? Yeah. I was a little worried about you. That was a long training session. Yeah. I was fighting mental simulations of Frieza and the others from back then. Frieza? That guy's a real piece of work. Well, if I'm gonna face you know who, I'll need to train extra hard. Otherwise, I might lose. Who's you know who? Well, you should be able to figure that out yourself. Huh? All right, I'm in tip-top shape. Let's go! You're late, Kakarot. Sorry, I was just getting ready to fight you. And I guess I lost track of time. <laughs> <laughs> this is the day I defeat you. That's the spirit. We'll just have to see if I can one-up you this time. Shut your mouth. This is it. Prepare to lose. Intense training you spoke of. Going up against someone like you it wouldn't be any fun if I didn't give it a hundred percent. Show me what a hundred percent looks like coming from you. Quick work of you if you tried holding back, but that no longer seems necessary. Don't worry about me holding anything back, especially when I'm up against you. Don't overestimate me. Dang that little bastard. Whoa! 
begins now! Right! <laughs> That's what I like to see! This is starting to get tough. Get ready! Here it comes! This is what it is. For the first time, on that day my body was shattered, and I've carried that loss with me!
I've got to hand it to you, Vegeta. Stop patronizing me, Kakarot. I've been training non-stop in order to finally defeat you. 
Thanks to your hard work, I suppose we'll just have to call this one a draw. <laughs> what do you mean, a draw? Nonsense. You want to end it already? I'm not done yet. I still have energy. This next move will determine the winner. Huh? Prepare yourself, Kakarot. Uh, hold on. Are you sure? You're in pretty bad shape. You're not doing much better. Ready or not, here it comes. Sweet victory will be mine! Take this! Whoa, stop! Why don't we take a break first? I want this! I want that! Shopping is so fun! Huh. Hey, did you feel that? The ground just started shaking and the wind picked up out of nowhere. Yeah, you're right. I wonder what's going on. Why do I feel like this is somehow Goku's fault? <laughs> no way. Goku's been so much more relaxed recently. Why would that change out of nowhere? You don't know that, man. It's been this peaceful because he's bottling it up. It's not just him. Vegeta does the exact same thing. I bet this is happening because they're bored and are fighting each other. Ugh! Uh, <laughs> that makes a lot of sense. Can't say you're wrong. <sighs> After all that, it's still a draw. It's not over yet. Sorry, I can't even lift a finger. Yep, that's it for me. It's the same for you, right? I hate to admit it, but I accept a draw. Just for now, but I vow to get even stronger. And next time, I will destroy you. <laughs> I had a feeling you'd say that. <sighs> Kakarot. Boo! Mr. Satan and everyone went through a lot to get this. Nice. 
As the Earth was brought to the brink of destruction, our heroes came up with a plan. They resurrected the souls destroyed by Majin Buu using the power of the Dragon Balls. 
Afterwards, the newly revived people of Earth rallied together and gave their energy to Goku's super spirit bomb, allowing him to defeat Majin Buu. And so, Goku and his friends saved the Earth yet again. Finally, after countless threats to the planet, a true and lasting peace was achieved, and the inhabitants of Earth were allowed to rest easy thanks to the Z Fighters. So 10 years peacefully went by. Looks like Mr. Satan is the same as ever. <laughs> Looks like it's about time. So early, Pan. Sorry, but I just couldn't wait to see you, Grandpa. <laughs> I see. Goodness, aren't you two extra cheerful this morning? Yep. Morning, Grandma. Are you doing laundry? I sure am. The weather today is perfect for drying clothes outside. Oh, by the way, Goku, I know it's still early, but do you think you could go catch us some fish? I completely forgot that Gohan and Videl mentioned they were coming for breakfast, and we definitely don't have enough to feed everyone. Just leave it to me. How many should I get? We'll need at least this many. And can you hurry? Gohan and the others should be here soon. Got it. I'm actually pretty hungry myself. I'll be right back. I'm going too. Great. I could use the company. Hooray! I'm sure you two will be perfectly fine, but be careful out there, okay? Yep. Okay. An age of progress. Prelude to a new battle. Let's see, where do you think we should fish? Catch some fish here. All right. <laughs> oh, get a load of that. Oh, get a 
out of that? We're not quite there yet. We still need a few more fish. All right. much should be enough. Wow! We cut so many, Grandpa! We should head back home. I'm getting pretty hungry. <laughs> yeah! Mom and Dad are probably waiting for us. Yeah. Oh, boy! I can't wait to eat breakfast! Hmm? What is it, Grandpa? Did you see something? Is it the fish? It's nothing. <laughs> There's no doubt about it. I've been waiting years to fight him again. Awesome! It looks like he's heading to the arena. I don't get it. You were waiting for someone? <laughs> I'll tell you about it later. Right now, it's time to eat. Grandpa, I want to know now! Oh, there you are, Dad. I hope you've been behaving, Pan. I've been with Grandpa the whole time. We caught a whole bunch of fish for breakfast. Whoa, look at that. You sure did. I'll start cooking things up right away. What? You want to enter the World Tournament tomorrow? Yep. I just made up my mind. I don't understand what you would even get out of it. It's not like anyone there could pose a challenge for you. Oh, I get it. You're after the prize money, aren't you? If you want money so badly, maybe you should go out and get a real job. Oh, hold on a sec. Th that's not the reason at all. There's a really strong fighter who's about to reveal himself to the world, and I want to see him fight up close. Wow. If you're this worked up, he must be the real deal. Do you think he's really that strong? Yeah. I haven't met him yet, but I can tell from his key alone. You get to fight tough opponents, Grandpa? Lucky. I want to join too. Now, now, Pan. This isn't pretend fighting, you know. That's right. You're still too little to compete. No, I'm not! Oh, come on! Pan will be fine! I've been training her up! Uh-huh! Is that so? Well, if your grandpa says it's okay... Uh... Fine. I guess you can participate. But if things get dangerous, we're pulling you out. Of course! Thank you! Why don't you sign up for it too, Goten? Me? Yeah, why not? Come on, it's not like you're busy or anything. Uh, um, I think I'll pass. I actually have a date planned tomorrow. A date, huh? Well, I'm sure you can reschedule it to another day. The tournament only comes around once a year. Well, I think it's a fantastic idea. You haven't been getting enough exercise lately, Goten. Hey, aren't you supposed to be on my side, Mom? You're not a child anymore. You don't need me to fight your battles. And if we're being honest, it's not like you're going to use the time to study anyway. You might as well take this opportunity to stay in fighting shape. Oh. <laughs> Mom sure has come around over the years. Yes! It's settled then! I'm gonna take Pan for some training now! Why don't you tag along, Goten? That's a good idea! Oh, man! Do I have to? Alright! It's about time we made our way to the mountain! Yay! You ready to go, Goten? 
Oh, I just remembered. I gotta get something really quick. Go on without me and I'll catch up. Really? Well, I guess it can't be helped. Come on, Grandpa. Sure. Don't take too long, okay? You got it. <laughs> Looks like someone's raring to go. This is the perfect chance to show me what you've got. I don't want you holding anything back. You got it. I'm feeling extra powerful today. I can't wait. Watch me, okay, Grandpa? Come on, man. Try to counter my attack. Whoops. Oh, sorry about that. I figured you would dodge it. Okay, pick up the pace. Whoops, oh, sorry about that. I figured you would dodge it. You know you can do better now. Okay, hope you're ready for this. Get distracted. Stay focused on the fight at hand. Come on, get up! You're not ready to quit, are you? I'm fine! I won't give up that easily! Ah! Ah! Whoa! <laughs> me, there's a good chance you'll get pretty far in the world tournament. You think so? That's great! I wanted to surprise you, Grandpa, so I've been training really hard in secret. <laughs> I see! Well, I like your spirit! <laughs> <laughs> hmm, where did Goten run off to? I'd better go check on him. I want to come along too! Why don't you take a break? We just had a pretty intense workout. Don't worry, I'm fine. All right, I guess you can come with. Nice and easy, nice and easy. I can't let Dad hear me. So what is it that you don't want me hearing about? <gasps> oh, hey, Dad. And Pam's with you, too. Come on, Goten, what's the holdup? 
I want to train some more and get stronger with you. So did you end up finding what you were looking for? Uh, I haven't yet. I mean, it's not that I was looking for anything in particular. The truth is I forgot to do something. I'll see you later. Huh? The tournament's tomorrow, remember? You don't have much time. It's been a while since you last fought, hasn't it? Let's train a little. Shake off the rust, huh? What do you say? Nah, I think I'm good. Besides, other than you, I doubt anyone there could beat me anyway. Aren't you forgetting someone? <laughs> right. I'm pretty sure I can take you on in a fight, Pan. Nuh-uh. <laughs> oh, really? You seem pretty confident there. Why don't you prove it? Uh, I don't feel like it right now. Also, I still have to do that thing, so maybe next time. Well, I'm sure you can do whatever it is another time. Yeah, I can even help you out later, too. Oh, don't worry, I can take care of it myself. That's enough stalling. Come on, Goten, let's get going already. Wait, I told you I didn't want to come along. All right, then. I guess I'll spar with you for a little bit. It might even help me get warmed up. But... Uh, okay, I'll fight you. What about me? Why don't you work on practicing your flying technique? If you learn to control your key, you'll be able to fly super fast. Hmm, let's see. All right, how does taking a lap around the world sound? Sure, I can do that. I'll be back soon. Awesome. Be careful, okay? Got it. Whoa! She disappeared in the blink of an eye. <laughs> yep. She just keeps on getting stronger and stronger. But now it's your turn. Better take this seriously, or you might get hurt. Uh, fine, but go easy on me. Show me what you've got, Goten. Don't hold back on me. Uh, I guess I don't have a choice in the matter. Pay more attention, Goten. You're wide open. Dang it. I can't keep up with his movements at all. <laughs> this is what happens when you let yourself get rusty. Uh, would you go a little easier, please? Uh, don't tell me that's all you've got, Goten. Uh, here I go. Go ten, otherwise you'll get hurt. Oh, come on, give me a break. You just need to focus. Expecting things to be easy will only get you hurt. Even in spawn, that would be a huge problem. I miss out on my date. Ah! Then you better get on the ball, Go ten. Come on, Go ten. Let's see what you can do. Okay, fine. Here I come, Dad. Yeah, you.
losing on the fight. Took things a little bit too far. <sighs> that really hurt. Don't tell me that's all you've got, Goten. I give up. You're way too strong, Dad. Don't throw in the towel already. It's been a while since we trained together. Let's make the most of it. Wait, I need a break. I don't understand. How come he never swings by to see us? I'm going to get to the bottom of this. <sighs> One of these days, the shoe's gonna be on the other foot. <laughs> hmm? Vegeta? Bulma? Wow, what a surprise! How you doing? Now you wouldn't know that, would you, Goku? How could you? You never call, and if we didn't come to visit you, we'd probably never see you again! Hey, come on! You know that's not true! Didn't we see each other just the other day? It's been five years! Every time we plan a get-together with everyone, you say you have to train! Well, that's true. Huh. I guess it has been a long time. Right? Huh? What do you mean? Well, it's just that you look way older. Shut your rude mouth! I'll have you know that most people think I look pretty good for my age. Excuse me for not being an alien monster that never changes or gets old. We Saiyans evolved as a warrior race. We retain our youthfulness so we can fight longer. Huh. Too bad you didn't evolve enough brains to have good manners. By the way, Kakarot, is it true that you're going to be fighting in the World Tournament? Yep, sure am. You should fight too. Vegeta, you can't beat those stadium hot dogs. Hot dogs? Enough already. Tell me the real reason you're fighting. I'd really rather talk about the hot dogs. But anyway, there's this guy who signed up to fight yesterday, and I think he might be really strong. Really? You think I would sense a spirit like that? <laughs> you would, if he wasn't suppressing his energy. No, this guy's something else. We may have a challenge on our hands. <laughs> I don't believe it. A real fighter on this planet. Is he an alien? Nope, this guy's an Earthling. An Earthling? Wait, do you mean he's some kind of android, Kakarot? Nope, he's 100% human. There's no way! You two are the best. Give me a break. How could an Earthling possibly be on par with you and Vegeta? Hmm? Hey! Trunks! Good to see you, dude. Now, Trunks, hay is for horses. Yeah. There you are, Goten. I thought that you'd be training. So are you going to be competing in the tournament? Or what? Yeah, my dad's making me fight. It's not like I wanted to sign up. I actually had a date. Until he forced me to cancel it. Aw, oh, come on, Goten. It's not so bad. There's plenty of time for your date after the tournament. <laughs> Looks like your son has the same slacker attitude as mine. <laughs> Seems so. Well, people tend to soften up a bit when things are peaceful. Huh? Grandpa! Now there's a real go-getter. My goodness! Look, it's Pan! Hi there! Grandpa, I'm done flying around the world! 
Oh, wow! Nice job! I think that was your fastest time yet! Do you think I'll be ready for tomorrow? Huh? Hold on a sec. What did you say? Is Pan gonna be fighting in the tournament too? Yep, of course I am! What? Are you sure? Goku, you know there's not going to be a junior division at the World Tournament this year, right? Don't tell me she's competing against adults! Well, you guys don't have to worry about Pan at all. She can hold her own in any division. She might not be able to take home the championship, but she'll do fine. She's got the right attitude. I'll enter as well. And guess what else? Trunks is too. Uh. If you refuse, you can say goodbye to half your weekly allowance. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Guess you're coming along. Right. I think that's enough training for today. Let's go home. Good. I feel like I'm about to drop dead. Aw, oh, do we have to? I can keep going. How? Wow. You're a bundle of energy, aren't you, Pan? It's funny. You remind me a lot of Goku when he was little. <laughs> It's late. We should get going as well. Say hi to Chi-Chi for me, okay? Sure. See you tomorrow at the tournament. Yeah. Hey, Trunks, we're training when we get home. Got it? Uh, sure sounds good to me. I was already planning on doing a little extra to get ready for tomorrow anyway. All right, let's start heading back. We're home! Hmm... Huh? Is something wrong? Oh, I'm fine. Welcome back! I was thinking it would be nice if everyone got together tomorrow to cheer you all on, so I tried calling Master Roshi, but I couldn't reach him at all. I don't know what's going on, but I hope he's okay. Hmm... He's probably just out and about. Maybe his phone's broken or something? Probably. And it is Master Roshi we're talking about. I'm sure he's fine. I mean, I could swing by and see how he's doing. I can tell him about the tournament while I'm there. Would you? That'd make me feel a lot better. I want to go with you, Grandpa. <laughs> you should stay home and rest up. I want you to be in tip-top shape for tomorrow. Aww. Fine, then. Hurry back, okay? Right. I'll be home before you know it. Mr. Oshi! You were here the whole time? Huh? Well, if it isn't Goku. It's been so long since you've come by. I could have kicked a bucket and you never would have known. <laughs> Sorry about that. You can keep your apologies. Just stop by every once in a while. So what was it you wanted to talk to me about? Oh, Chi-Chi was trying to call you earlier, but you didn't pick up. That's why I came by to check up on you. Did she? Now that you mention it, I haven't heard my phone ring at all lately. Maybe it's broken. No kidding? Is that all it was? Whatever, I'll look into it later. What is it that Chi-Chi wanted to talk to me about? Oh, right. Well, I'll be fighting in the World Tournament tomorrow, and we wanted to let you know. Huh? The World Tournament? It's been a while since you participated, so I stopped paying attention to it. <sighs> that brings me back. I remember the first time you fought in that competition all those years ago. <laughs> right. Back when I was training with Krillin. Yeah, you made us do all kinds of crazy stuff. <laughs> you needed every bit of that training to get stronger. And you made it through with flying colors. Yep, before I knew it, me and Krillin got super strong thanks to your instruction. As I recall, you couldn't take the championship in the end. I'm betting it was a humbling experience for you and Krillin. Yeah! I wonder what the old coot who beat me is up to nowadays. Oh, he's doing fine. Just fine. 
Huh? It almost sounds like you know him. Yeah, of course not. I mean, I imagine he's doing well, that's all. Whew. That was a close one. Hmm, if you say so. <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, how do you feel about the tournament? I'm just as ready as always, and I'm pretty excited. You should come watch if you've got some free time. Vegeta, Goten, Trunks, and Pan will be competing too. Even Pan, huh? That sounds like fun. Although, whenever we have a world tournament, something outlandish always seems to happen. I wonder what it'll be this time. <laughs> well, whatever happens, we'll take care of it like always. <laughs> I'm sure you will. Give him hell, Goku. You bet, Master Roshi. Oh, you're home, Goku. Did you tell Master Roshi about the tournament? Uh-huh. He said he's looking forward to it and to give him hell. That's great to hear. But he did chew me out for not coming to see him more often. <laughs> well, I don't blame him in the least. You always put things off unless it's somehow related to training. You better get to bed early tonight so you can be rested for tomorrow. I told Master Roshi the tournament was tomorrow. Maybe I should just eat dinner and get to bed now. But I still need to get ready, though. I have no idea what I'm going to wear tomorrow. Will you help me decide, Goku? Huh? Uh, it's not like you'll be fighting in the matches. I mean, does it really matter? What did you just say? Huh? No, oh, nothing. Nothing at all. That's what I thought. Anyway, I better get ready. Jeez, that was too close. Phew. I've been waiting for such a long time, and it's finally happening tomorrow. The following day, This place is really packed, isn't it? This feels less like a tournament and more like a festival. Yes, it's about time! The world tournament begins. Goku is unstoppable. So we've got some time to kill. Wait a second. We still have to meet up with Bulma and the others. It's fine. I'll keep an eye out for him while we're exploring. All right. Let's go. Yay! They sure get along well. Keep your eyes peeled for Vegeta while we check this place out. She ran off somewhere. She'll be back soon. By the way, Kakarot, is you know who here, too? Huh? Oh, yeah. I haven't seen him yet, but he'll show up. Really? I don't sense anyone powerful nearby. Well, just think of him as something to look forward to. <laughs> you and your mysterious act. <laughs> 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 da. 
Whatever. Have you signed up already? Oh, I was thinking I should get around to that soon. Chi Chi and the others are already at the sign up table. Wanna head over? In a moment. Bulma should be back soon. Well, if it isn't Goku and Pan! Yo! Hi, Pan! <laughs> Hi, Bula! I haven't seen you in forever! I heard you were gonna be fighting, is that true? Yep, I've been training super hard for this! Just don't get hurt, okay? Whoa, is that really you, Bula? You've gotten a heck of a lot bigger since the last time I saw you! That's what happens when you don't see someone for five years! By the way, where is everyone? Chi Chi and the others are already here. Boma and everybody. We're finally all together. Whoa, there's so many people here. Is this everyone? Nope. Master Roshi should be coming too. Hey, Goku! Huh? Hey, everybody, how you doing? Well, to tell you the truth, we're a little peyote at you. How come you never call or come by to visit us anymore? Would it kill you to check in on your friends? <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> it's funny. Bulma scolded me for the same thing. You guys have phones too, right? Please, I can't figure mine out. Right. Hey, are you gonna compete too, Piccolo? And step into the ring with a monster like you? No thanks. I'm gonna kick back and enjoy the show. I'm too old for this. Come on. It'll be fun. And I don't believe that too old crap. You haven't changed in ten years. Oh, wow. Where did the time go? For all of you who are fighting, you'd better not injure any of the regular participants. Also, no one is allowed to fly during your matches. If you create a scene, it'll only lead to a huge headache. Yeah, I know, Mom. Hey, Vegeta! You're the person I'm most worried about here! Safe to say he hasn't changed a bit. You have to go, Grandpa! Right. Okay, see you later! Yeah, don't make us wait another ten years! Sure! Oh man, I don't know what it is about that guy, but you just can't stay mad at him. It's impossible! Listen up. We're gonna do the same thing we always do, Boo. I want you to go beat up all the challengers and qualify for the finals. Then you're gonna throw the championship match against me. Hmm. Huh? Now what? Don't tell me it's another fan bearing gifts. I thought I told security not to let anyone else through. Hi. Goku? Hey, it's been a while, buddy. Don't forget about me, Gramps. Oh, it's my favorite little girl in the world. How's my baby doing? <laughs> I'm fine. Thank you for asking. Did you come all the way here just to cheer on your grandpa? Uh-uh. I'm going to win the whole tournament. Grandpa G's fighting, too. So is Goten and Trunks. Even Vegeta signed up. What did you just say? Yeah, we're all gonna fight. It should be super fun. Ready to rumble anytime! No, this can't be happening! It's fine, don't worry about it. If one of us makes it to the final round, we'll throw the fight and let you take home the victory. Really? You do that for me? Of course! But that's if all of us win all our matches. Someone else might make it instead. <laughs> No, right, that's true. But if you try your hardest, you just might make it. Excuse me, champ. All our friends and family just got here? 
but they were told there weren't any more open seats left in the stadium. Oh, is that what they told you? <laughs> well, I'll give the staff a good talking to. Yep, they'll find something for the champ's family. <laughs> Mama, I can see everything. Isn't that nice? Wow, Goku really said that? Yeah. You think someone that strong would actually show up? He is not the type to make things up. He must have sensed something unusual. But you aren't sensing anything, right? I'm not. But knowing Goku, he'll try to face off against this mystery fighter as soon as possible. He'll fight him in the first round so he can go all out. I get it. Boo's entering the tournament too. Dad'll ask him to use his magic to set the bracket exactly how he wants it. Correct. So basically, whoever Dad fights in the first round is the guy. What's that? I got it from a staff member. It's a list of all the fighters who got past the prelims. It's gotta be one of these people. Let's see here. Knock. Wild Tiger. Oob. Captain Chicken. Nareg, and some guy named Odakoski. Who could it be? Testing, testing. Ladies and gentlemen, your attention please. The drawing to determine the tournament bracket has come to a close. And in a few moments, we'll kick off the main event. Looks like you're up first, Pan. Yeah, I'll do my best. Come on, why do I gotta fight some teeny tiny kid? The mighty wild tiger doing battle with a toddler? Is this some kind of joke? <laughs> Jeez, Pan is so lucky. How come I'm stuck with Boo in the first round? Well, if you had trained more, you'd have nothing to worry about. This is on you, kiddo. Kakarot. Is this really the guy? The one you were talking about? Yep. Impossible. He doesn't seem very powerful. Could it be someone else? Nope. I'm positive it's him. Ugh. Mother was right when she warned me about the tournament. Even though I'm the strongest in the village, it might not be enough to win. This is a gathering of the best in the world. Some of them may even be more powerful than me. Oh, heavens above. How am I supposed to get out of this situation? I already promised everybody I'd win the grand prize and that I'd bring back a ton of food. Oob. He's been waiting for this chance for a long time. Don't be deceived by his appearance. This guy's the real deal, all right. But how could you possibly know that? There's nothing special about him. It sounds strange, but before I destroyed Boo's evil form for good, I made a request of him. I asked him to come back as someone good. That way we could have another fight again. I hope you're reborn as someone good this time. I want to fight you one-on-one -on -one again. I'll be waiting for you. And I'm gonna keep getting stronger. And apparently, King Yem overheard me. So he decided to do me a favor and fulfill my request. What? Hold on. There's no way. You're saying that boy is Boo? Yep. That's him. I'm even more sure of it now. Haven't you noticed? That boy's name is Oob. See? It's Boo spelled backwards. <clears throat> yep, I can't wait to see how powerful he really is. It's gonna be awesome. Hi, hey, old man. Looks like you're my opponent for the first round. What's this? Guess Grandpa here's got an attitude. Why are you so old and senile that you can't even hear anymore? Hi! 
way. <laughs> My opponent's forfeited. I'll see you in round two. <sighs> He's lucky, all things considered. I was wondering. We're free to do whatever we want until the match starts, right, Dad? Yep. But don't run off too far, and talk to that announcer when you're ready to fight. Sounds good. All right. I guess I got some time to kill. Hey, Trunks. Want to walk around? Sure. What should I do? Well, I've got some time to wander. It's time to crown the new World Martial Arts Champion! Of all those who entered, only 12 competitors remain! And in the end, one of them will earn the right to fight for the title of World Champion along with the prize money! Without further ado, our first match! The Fierce Wild Tiger faces off against newcomer Pan! A talented young girl competing at the tender age of four. But don't worry, her grandfather is none other than the one, the only, Mr. Satan! Allow me to introduce the fighters. On this end, we have the enormous Wild Tiger. And in the orange is the adorable Pan. Give it your best, Pan. Careful. Don't hurt him too bad. You'd better not lose, big guy. <laughs> so this is the champ's granddaughter, huh? Still, it's embarrassing having to fight a child. I'll just flick her out of bounds. Now for our first match of the day. Ready? Begin! Go ahead you for this, kid. Okay. I'll show you what I've got. Charging up our energy! 
could she be planning? Wild Tiger's strength is restored! Face off! Oh, crush you! Come here, girly! Poor baby, are you okay? Yep. <laughs> Way to go, Pan. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, bout two is about to begin. Competitors Goku and Oob, please come see me when you're ready to battle. It's your turn, Grandpa. Good luck. Thanks. Hi there! My name's Goku. Huh? Uh, hey! Good luck out there. You too. Um, I'm Oob. Nice to meet you. Ladies and gentlemen, time for the next round! Please join me in welcoming our challengers, Goku and the youngster Oob! You may recognize Goku as he's appeared in numerous tournaments over the years and is a former world champion himself, a remarkable fighter who's truly one of a kind. If you folks don't mind me gushing a bit, in my opinion, this man is second to none in this year's world tournament competition. And if I may be so bold, I predict that it'll be Goku and Boo fighting for a spot in the championship match. Facing this titan is young Oob. He hails from a small village on a faraway island and is just 10 years old. This young man may be small, but he's got the support of his five younger siblings rooting for him back home. Oob entered the tournament in hopes of winning the prize money, which he plans to use to buy food for his village. What a shame. I can't believe how unlucky he is. He came all this way to the tournament, only to get put up against Goku in his first match. Now this is the real championship match. All right, both fighters, are you ready? Very well, without further ado, let the match begin! Uh, hey buddy, relax a little, okay? You can't fight when you're so tense. Uh, right. Hmm, what should I do about this? Maybe he'll calm down if we fight a little. That's something that always works for me. I mean, I might as well give it a shot. Okay, don't hold back on me. Ah! Hey, are you all right? What did you say? 
heavens. I have to beat this guy. I gave them my word. I promised mother and father I'd win this tournament and bring home the prize money. Get me! Just like I thought. I have to beat him. No matter what it takes. I gave them my word that I'd come back victorious. I made everyone a promise. That's why I won't lose it! I have to! to do that surprised huh i take it you don't know how to fly yet right oob that's a bit of a shame but you never had a teacher so it's only natural you wouldn't have learned how huh? i'm sorry about everything i said about you and your family i didn't mean it i just wanted to see how strong you really were see you were bottling up your strength i had to make you angry for you to unleash it but it worked out Plus, you got to learn a bit more about yourself. Look, you're really strong. That was a great fight. The problem is, you don't quite know how to control your power yet. I'm betting you've never fought like this before, have you? Uh, no. Yep. That's what I thought. Hey, I know. I've made a decision. Why don't I teach you to fight? I could even come live in your village. How do you like the sound of that, Oob? I guarantee you'll get stronger. Oh, um, thank you. But you see, we're poor, so I have to work. Sure, fighting is fun, but I just don't have time for it. Oh yeah, that is a problem. But we just need to get you money, right? If we can find a sponsor for you, then everything will be fine. Wait a sec, I know just the guy. Mr. Satan has a ton of money. Really? He does? Yep, we're covered. Oh, by the way, if anything bad ever happens to me, it'll be up to you to keep the world safe. This is gonna be awesome. Huh? Be right back. Hey guys, sorry to spring this on you without any warning, but I'm gonna go live in Oob's village so I can train him. I'm not sure how long this will take, but I promise, I'll swing by and visit. Thanks for understanding. Uh, hold on. You're leaving us? Later. Come Not on. Again. Grandpa, no! <laughs> What's wrong? Grandpa, you're not really leaving, are you? Yeah.
Hey, come on, don't cry, Pan. It's not like we'll never get to see each other again. Dry those tears, kiddo, because I'm going to come visit you. You promise? Yeah, I promise. But you can't be sad while I'm gone. Okay. All right, that's my girl. Sorry about this, Vegeta. I was really looking forward to another fight with the Prince of All Saiyans. We couldn't have fought for real anyway. Next time we fight, we'll need an entire planet to serve as our arena. <laughs> You're too much. We'll settle this one of these days, and I'll defeat you once and for all. Sure. Hey, you ready? Let's get going. Uh, yeah. Okay. Your village is to the south of here, right? Hold on tight. <sighs> he did it again. You know how Goku is. I haven't seen him this happy in a while. <laughs> you can't fool me. You say you're training him to replace you. But I know the real reason you want that boy to get even stronger. You're always looking for yet another sparring partner. Whoa! Hey, Ooh, once you're finished with all your training, why don't you and I have another match so we can test the limits of your power? Sure, why not? It'll be really fun. To be honest with you, I can hardly wait. Don't you think this is thrilling, Oob? The two of us going head to head in an all out fight. Yeah, that's the spirit. Your training starts now. Yes. You got more than that. Come on, let it out! <laughs> <laughs> 